Hello parents and carers. As you might be aware, we've started using Class Dojo to be able to record children's reading logs so that we've got an accurate picture of what they're reading in school and at home. Very shortly, uh, you'll be receiving a bookmark which looks like this, which is personalised to your child with your child's name on and a QR code. This QR code is what you can scan uh, to be able to record what they've read with you. In the meantime, though, you'll be getting a Dojo message, which looks a little bit like this one at the top of the screen, uh, which will allow you to click on that link uh, to be able to follow uh, to get to the same place that that QR code will get you to. When you click on this link um, at home, you will be presented with this screen. Um, you can print this QR code. That's the QR code that will appear on the bookmark and stick it on your fridge if you wanted to. But this link here will allow you to be able to uh, directly go to your child's portfolio to be able to answer the task that your teacher has, uh, has set. And when you have uh, clicked on this, this link, you'll then be taken to your child's um, portfolio and, and the screen that your child can see. Now, if your child's got their own iPad or device at home, you might want to do this so that they can see what points they're getting and, and the things that are happening in their class. But I just want to show you how, as a parent, you will then answer the tasks, which are the reading records. So I'll just click play on this screenshot. So uh, once you're in here, uh, if you click on, it says demo class, but that will be the name of your class. Click in there and you'll see the list of to-do items. Select the uh, reading task for that particular week. And then that will take you into being able to record um, either a video or uh, of your child reading or, or to be able to write in uh, what pages your child has read, um, how many uh, questions they've answered, uh, did they read with fluency and expression, so that you can then submit that to your child's class teacher um, on the app so that we've got a record of what, um, what reading they've done at home. Uh, and once you've um, uh, spelt things incorrectly and used autocorrect in your message, uh, you can then uh, click on the uh, little blue uh, corner um, and that will then uh, submit that activity. And you'll see in here all the different activities uh, that your teacher might have set for your child um, and the, the portfolio where it says pending there at the bottom. That's the item that's just been sent for your teacher to approve. So I hope that makes sense. If you are having any issues, then please do see your class teacher. Um, if they can't help you, uh, then they'll uh, send me uh, send you to me or or send me to you uh, so that I can support you as well. Uh, but we're hoping that this um, bookmark uh, that you can see at the left hand side of the screen will make things a little bit easier. It will stay in your child's reading book um, as a bookmark, but then you'll be able to scan that with your uh, phone uh, after you've listened to them read to be able to just update their reading record on uh, Class Dojo. Thank you very much.